In the earlier video, we have seen that how to create a response surface design or central composite design, the basic to the response surface design in Microsoft Excel. So this is for the two square design uh, response surface. Uh, uh, central composite design and to complete a two square design we need four replication then we added four axial points or stair points and then five central uh, points now for the um, half fraction of two to the power uh, five minus one or five factors experiment two level each we have 16 basic um, uh, runs uh, with half fraction and then we added 10 axial and stair points points and then six uh, center points now we can do all of this design in mini tab um, just go to so here's a mini tab you click on a stat and then design of experiment doe and response surface and then the first thing you see uh, create response surface design now mini tab will not allow you to analyze these without creating its own design I will show you how to analyze uh, the um, already existed data or the design if the design is created in Excel because this is simple you probably don't need many tab to do it so if you have already collected data I will show you how to analyze those in using response surface method so to create the response surface design basically stat doe and then response surface and create response surface design click on that and then it will give you how many factors if you want to have just two factors and always this is two level each uh, so you can just see for two factor there are a bunch of um, experiments available for two packs if it's unblocked with 13 run block with 14 runs available this is the only choice you have for two factors you cannot really have a half fraction for two factors so that's the design choice and the design is which design do you want do you want uh, full factorial or do you want to run two blocks so if you want to do this you can simply just hit ok and then I guess you leave everything as it is and how do you want it low high how do you want to set it um, and then options just leave everything as it is result nothing just leave everything as it is so basically that is the um, layout um, for the uh, let me copy that in Excel so that I can show you side by side what we have created in Excel basically exact same as what we found in mini tab so just put it here so as you can see mini tab had something called standard water and run water run water you should always be running things in random so when you create it in Excel you should create a column called random to and then in Excel you can do just type R A N D and then just like this it will create a bunch of random numbers you can sort this uh, data set by random number and then it will be just a standard order will be messed up it is easy to create the design using a standard order and then once you create this design you should always be running the experiments by random order not by the standard order so if you just sort that based on the random what is gonna do is basically number 11 combination you will be running fast so this is the run order you can just simply add one column here say uh, run order like that so it's gonna be like that so So Minitab basically gives you all these run water, standard water. Uh, but if I sort this data with um, the standard water, you will see that we got the exact same as what we have created. Uh, let's sort this with the standard water. So as you can see, this look exact same exact same exact same exact same this comes from mini tab let's do it half fraction of 2 to the power 5 and then let's go to mini tab and then basically i'm gonna delete all of these and then i probably didn't have to delete it mini tab would generate anyway so let's go instead design of experiment response surface and then create response surface now i want to do it with five factors and the design i would like to have is a half fraction design and um, just choose this first one and then there is no block so half fraction design total 32 runs um, 
alpha value to hit OK. So as you can see, this is the exact same as what he got in 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 MS Excel. So let me copy it here, sort this data based on the standard order. Then you will see that now I sorted this standard order. So let me make it a little bit smaller. So as you can see, all of these is exact same as these, and then this two is started. Uh, so far 16 runs they're the half fraction of uh, five variables and then next 16 runs next 10 runs are with the uh, two let me make it this way yeah so next 10 runs with these um, axial points or star points and then rest six runs is the center points here in mini tab it's just a point type one type two type three um, it's kind of do the shortcut plus minus here we have wrote corner points and axial points and star points basically you can just copy and then paste it here to replace that so you can do it very quickly in in microsoft excel and you could choose so many other options if you want so go to stat doe response surface create response surface now you got bunch of designs the more variable I include the more designs you have so you don't have to do anything manually it will mini table do everything automatically for you